There are 18 starters, but, say the experts, only three horses in the race. The favourite, Nono Alco from France. Grand Orient, an outsider. Regular Guy, another outsider, but outsiders do sometimes win. Northern Taste and Bustino. Outsider, Snow Knight. Second favourite, Giacometti, number th on Hutchinson, up on Grey Thunder. Willie Carson on Court Dancer. Nono Alco with Yves Saint-Martin. Tony Murray on Giacometti. Lester Piggott on Arthurian brought the odds down from 40 to 20 to 1. Going down to the start. Imperial Prince with Jeff Lewis. Irish Horse Miss Tigre with Christy Roach up and Nono Alco. Snow Knight alive and kicking. But the experts say if jockey Brian Taylor is going to win, he'll have to get off and walk it. In fact, Snow Knight could start without Brian anyway. On the day, the odds against Snow Knight are 50 to 1, and mean odds at that. Hope of Holland with Greville Starkey up, another outsider. Sin Y Sin with Eric Gelder. And the ladies say, why not? Live Arrow with Dick Marshall. And they're off. Starting uphill to a left-hand turn, Giacometti can go out in front right away or wait and risk getting locked in. And Snow Knight is among the first to show with Grey Thunder, Imperial Prince and Giacometti. Snow Knight and Grey Thunder almost neck and neck in the lead. and Snow Knight still out in front, followed by Imperial Prince and Giacometti. Is Snow Knight in the lead from Imperial Prince and Giacometti? And the result looks surely between those third. Bustino goes in the fourth place. Then comes Northern Tate. And Nono Alco's got no chance. And they're running now towards the final furlong. And it's still Snow Knight in the lead from Imperial Prince and Giacometti. That's the leading three. Then comes Bustino. And in the final stage, it's still Snow Knight holding Imperial Prince. As they come up towards the line, it's Brian Taylor on Snow Knight in the lead from Imperial Prince. Bustino come along, take fourth place behind Giacometti. And the leading four followed by Northern Tate, Mr. Green, Nono Alco. Then comes Radical. Court Dancer finishes next in front of regular guy. Then comes Sin Y Sin, Arturian, Charlie Bubbles, and the last ones across the line, Barbary Corsair, as I look back, still two more to cross them, and that's Hope of Holland and finally Grand Orient. And so Snow Knight, who was beaten a short head by Giacometti at Doncaster last autumn, after winning two of his three previous races, certainly taken revenge with that horse. This year he's been beaten by Bustino in each of his races and once again he took revenge on another one of the contenders in this, the 195th running of the derby. Snow Knight 50 to 1, 11 Imperial Prince 20 to 1, 7 Giacometti 5 to 2 and 4th number 3 Bustino 8 to 1. It's a horse that really stayed out the mile and a half really well here this afternoon and did it the hard way and absolutely as far as I can see no hard luck stories, nothing really got near him. Uh, in the last two or three furlongs. A grand win that for English breeding too, with all this international breeding. Uh, this one, uh, Fire Streak, uh, by Fire Streak out of Snow Blossom, number 19, our winner this afternoon, Snow Knight.
Cephodamia being pressed by Snow Knight, behind Snow Knight is Boy, then comes Dahlia, then High Clear unleashing a run towards the stand side, they're coming to the two furlough marker, and Snow Knight has hit the front from Boy, but Dahlia is cruising on the stand side, and it's Snow Knight from Boy and Dahlia, and High Clear trying to get on turns with them, and Giancaro coming there strongly too, but it's Dahlia who's hit the front again, the 1973 winner's going to win it in 1974, it's Dahlia going clear again, being pressed by High Clear from the Queen, then comes Giancaro and Boy, as they do so now it's now imperial prince who dialed just in the lead from hibidamia little to choose between those two then comes high clear snow knight on the outside czar and dahlia dahlia trying to get an opening and two and a half furlongs still to run and it's jeff lewis on imperial prince who now takes off from hibidamia on the far side then on the near side is snow knight then make a run then it's dahlia and so they pass the two furlongs from home market and it's imperial prince and here comes death run dahlia dahlia comes right through in a few strides to hit the front and so they're just over a furlong out and it's dahlia now in the lead from imperial Prince on the far side, Snow Knight. Then comes Zara Jimson and Two Jaw Prey. But it's Dahlia all the way through the last foul on the Belle of France in the lead. But Imperial Prince is trying hard to get back on turn as they run up towards the line. It's Lester on Dahlia. Very comfortable victory over Imperial Prince. Snow Knight, Jimson, Two Jaw Prey. Then comes High Clear Zara.